Even now you made me step and poop. Now you just, <sighs> this can't be a serious video with you like this, Danny. She kept on talking about how sweet and gentle and patient you are and you are not being any of those things. Well, I appreciate you're not, oh no, oh no. Holy moly, stop it. Jolene, it's been a while since you've been the baby. You want to talk about how you feel about this? I hate to say it, but next year you're probably going to be in the same boat. You're mad? Jolene's always mad. Danny is not mad. Danny's like, oh, a new friend. Yay. She's the most sweet, gentle, like just docile little baby of all of them. And I have to give you, I have to, I have to give credit to Stella and Sadie for that because they took the beatings from her for me while I was being beat up on by Ruby. How do you feel about not being one of the, the baby babies anymore? You're, you're becoming a teenager. She's like, I don't care as long as you come out here and scratch me every once in a while. I'll be sweet to you if you'll be sweet to me. Are you going to be sweet to that new baby though? Yes? Okay. Oh, you're going to lick that baby? Okay. Oh, I love this cow, y'all. There's a lot going on down this hill here. And I know Lester's video on all of that for y'all. Tex? What's wrong, buddy? Don't worry, I'm not coming for you. Hey, I just got done talking nice about you. I'm going to go visit over here. Seriously, I wonder what he's thinking. I wonder when he looks out here and realizes this is not where we started. And he looks out at how many belong to him and to know that, hi baby, that his partner is over there recovering and is he proud? Sweetie, don't make me jump. I just got done saying the sweetest things, okay? I'll scratch you all you want. Is he proud? Is he curious? Is he being patient and waiting his turn? Is he all the, all the above? Is he tired because he helped her and walked with her all night? I just, sweetie, I am, they're, you're making me video gross things and you're making me, take me away from the sentiment of what I'm trying to talk about here, okay? I'm still scratching, I'm still scratching. Anyway, back to text. Is he like contemplating all of his life's decisions? Does he feel complete right now? Do you think he wonders about Huey and Santoro? And I don't even know if this one is a girl or boy. And is he, is he wondering that same thing? Like does he even, now you made me step and poop. Now you just, <sighs> this can't be a serious video with you like this, Danny. She kept on talking about how sweet and gentle and patient you are and you are not being any of those things. Well, I appreciate you're not, oh no, oh no. Holy moly, stop it. Okay, okay, sheesh. I guess I'm leaving the passion. Oh, what was that for? <sighs> you got mama time again. Ruby just wanted to let me know she loved me and that she was going back to dinner. Anyway, this makes 17 longhorns, 18 cows. Bovine? They're not all cows. I learned that too. Um, <laughs> sweetie, we really are blessed. And I remember the day that Tex and Santana came into our lives. And I remember watching them be so little but yet thinking they were so big at the time never in a million years did I imagine that we would be standing on 50 acres for them to graze on building a barn or that I would be even standing out here doing this after a summer of bottle feeding her never 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 so as I think through text and what his dreams may have looked like. 
Maybe it was this. Maybe this is what his father told him someday he would have. I could tell you that my mama never told me this is what I, what I would be doing one day. But I really feel blessed that it is the truth. Oh no, Pearl's here. This would be my exit from the pasture. Pearl's stepping up to the UFO. That means this lady is stepping out because I am not Longhorn Lester. This was not my dream. I'm blessed to be living it. I love every second of it, but, but this is why women live longer. No, true story. I'm proud for Tex. I'm proud of the family that he's built. I could never have imagined watching emotion in Longhorns like I've seen in all of them, but mostly he and Santiana. I really genuinely believe that they are special and unique. And that as much as people want to say that I humanize them, I've witnessed it with my own eyes that they have had real emotion. I've watched them care for each other. I've watched them fight in the same way that humans do. I've watched him bicker. I've, I've watched her be mad at him. I've watched him be mad at her. I've watched them both make mistakes. I've also watched them forgive each other. And that is so weird to say, but it's true. And now as we look across this pasture at the family that they've built, With some help, okay? With a little help, some outside help from some. It's hard not to literally count the blessings that have come from each one of them. The time that they've given us, the lessons that they've given us. Oh, the lessons that they've given us. <laughs> they really are special, y'all. And um, I love that we do this. So happy birthday, number 17. I can't wait to hear what we're going to name the very first baby born at the J&L Ranch. And I can't wait for all that are going to come as well.